Hi, Max and Lisa. It's Camilla here again. Um, thank you for your feedback from the wall and floor selections for your apartment. I'm so glad you are loving the feel of the colour scheme we have chosen. Um, I've really thought about the feedback you've given me from the first session and looking at the overall feel of the apartment. Um, I really wanted, I really loved working with you both to create a space for you to escape from your busy demands of work and relax and recharge. I have kept in mind the selection of furniture that you love to entertain, but you also wanted to keep the apartment with minimal maintenance and minimal cleaning. And so that's sort of what I kept in mind through the whole project. Um, looking firstly at the layout. So here we have the layout here. Um, it's for the living and the dining space. Um, I am sure not to clutter the space, but also given you the possibilities for entertaining. Um, so you can see over on this side, walking in, we've got your lounge area first, and then we'll be looking at your dining area. Okay, so for the feel of this beautiful apartment, I took inspiration from the existing industrial feel and added a contemporary undertone. I wanted to create a tranquil, relaxing environment, but still a visually interesting space. I know you love the urban environment and the New York culture and artwork, so I've brought some colour into the space. Okay, so firstly looking at the rug as you enter the home. So this one over here. It is a gorgeous Cavalier Bremworth 100% wool rug from New Zealand. Um, the colour of it is called Damask. It is a light grey with a black weave through it, which will tie in beautifully to the rest of your furniture. So looking in the lounge area, we have the Preston sofa over here from Coco Republic. It is a slimline, timeless design in a neutral finish. Accompanying it, we have in the lounge, oh, sorry, accompanying it, we have this, um, <clears throat> excuse me, sorry, a simple and modern cognac colored um, leather chair. Um, this is a bespoke piece. So it is handmade in Turkey and imported into Australia. Um, I've also taken some inspiration from the New York street art and the amazing colours. I sourced this sideboard, which you can see over here, which is in that amazing um, rich dark green that we had from the feature wall in your bedroom. Um, again, it is a custom made piece sold through Grazia & Co. When I saw it, I instantly knew it was the pop of colour I was looking for in your apartment. So as well, to reduce your cleaning, well, mostly dusting, I thought it would be a great additional storage for your books without them having to be on an open shelf. Okay, so moving over to the dining area. There is this beautiful solid um, oak timber with the steel legs. As I was conscious about space and not wanting it to feel overcrowded, I picked these Hoffman um, dining chairs which again are a timeless piece of furniture. They have a cane seat and backrest for added comfort. Since you said you loved artwork and culture, I have added this canvas up here, it's quite small, sorry, but this canvas up here, which um, again, it's gonna, sorry, it's gonna go into the dining area. It encompasses that urban environment of Melbourne with its culture and street art bringing an eye-catching piece into the home. Um, not to overcrowd your already gorgeous space, I have picked pieces of furniture I feel will complement the existing finishes and give you a space that you could extend on in the future. My main goal for your apartment was to create a tranquil environment that brings you joy and enables you to relax and recharge from your demanding careers. I hope you love the space as much as I've loved creating it for you. Thanks again, Max and Lisa, for giving me the opportunity to design your apartment. I hope I've given you a home which you can create lots of wonderful memories, as well as a sanctuary to escape the demands of work. If you feel there are any changes you would like me to make, please let me know. I look forward to chatting with you again soon. Thanks. Bye, guys.